I'm sorry. We um, rang the bell, but uh, no one answered. Surprising. Oh, well, come in, come in, come in. You're just in time for tea. Mom told me it gets kind of crazy around here. Like the Battle Royale, where two people go at it with no rules until there's only one left standing. <laughs> Out of the mouths of babes. <laughs> I'm 12. Oh, boy. I remember when I was 12. There was this girl that I just, I had the hots for her, but I was Daddy. so scared. Of, what was that church camp? Daddy! Edward! Um, where is, where's Michael? Uh, he went home. He's in a bad mood. Teenagers. Oh, yeah, well. What, uh, what brings you here? Well, I wanted to come by and personally invite you all to Jocelyn's christening. Really? How about we go get some hot chocolate and try some of Cook's raisin cookies? Did anyone ever tell you you look like the Dominator? You know, I get that a lot. Hmm. You know, uh, Jocelyn is Michael's sister. And of course we'll be there because there's nothing more important than family. Hey, what's going on? Uh, Lucky just left. He's taken himself off Claudia's case. Well, that's good news, no? Uh, I don't know. Because another detective will be assigned. He's going to take a look at Lucky's notes and he could possibly identify Maxie. Maxie? As a witness. What could Maxie possibly know about Claudia's well, death? Well, apparently she was outside Sonny's gate that night at 3 a.m. Okay, which means that she could have seen Sonny. Or Michael. You know, the position I hold comes with a cost. You seem like you have some regrets. Uh, if I could go back and do things differently, maybe I would have gotten together with some nice girl from the old neighborhood. And... Anyway, listen, um, you and Lulu, right? You guys haven't been together long. She's one in a million. Maybe you're too smart for this. Maybe you want something different. Well, you have everything. Yeah, it seems like I have everything, but you know what? I can't keep my family safe. I can, you know, put up as many walls as I, as I want, and hire as many guards as I want, but it's, they're always a target somehow. And I, you know, maybe you don't want this anyway, so... I'm just saying, think about it, that's all. Well, what about Jason? I love Jason. He's a, my best friend, he's like a brother to me, but he doesn't want to run the business. He's already made it clear that if I ever walk away, he wants to walk away with me, if we're both still standing. Well, there's gotta be someone who's been in your organization longer than you me. You got in front of a car to protect my son, save his life. You almost took a bullet from me, that takes guts. You can't teach that. It's not like everybody else in this business. You know, you got a bunch of animals, like Joey Limbo and the Zakars. You know, they, they have no sense of decency. They don't care who they hurt. I don't know, I don't know. what about uh, Johnny? Give, give Johnny everything that I have? Let me think about it. No. I mean, he wouldn't want it anyway. You know, his sister, you know put my family through hell, why am I going to pass it down to him? Michael expects to follow in your footsteps. All this is about making a better life for my children. Giving them choices that I didn't get. I don't care what Michael wants. Why are you talking about me with Dominic? Uh, I'll show myself out. You're supposed to be with your mother. What was all that about? Business. It's okay. I heard my name. Okay, I just, there's a chance that Dominic's gonna take over the organization one day. Because I never want you to. It's not like I'm retiring anytime soon. I, I, it's good to have a plan in place. Did I have no place in? I'm sorry, Michael, that's just the way it has to be. How much do you know about Dominic? Can't you see that he spends all of his time kissing her? I know you're upset, but don't forget who you're talking to. Look, it is not fair that Dominic gets everything that's mine and takes my place. Your place was never in the business. I am old enough to make my own decisions. It's a family business. I should be the one to take over. You're going to go to college. You're going to start your own business, a legitimate one. Whatever you want to do, you can do. You're, you, I didn't have any options. You, your brother, and your sister do. Why don't you trust me? 
Why can't you see that I can do what you do? I don't want you to do what I do. I want you to do better, son. You're always talking about family. But you trust Dominic, some stranger off the street, more than you do your own son. If Maxie can place Michael in the car with Sonny the night Claudia disappeared, the cops are going to bring him in for questioning. And you're worried that Michael won't be able to hold up under the pressure? Well, they're going to make him angry. Oh, and then he might lose control and blurt something out. Why didn't Maxie say anything? Yeah, because Lucky didn't press her. Well, they have history together. I guess that makes sense. Another detective probably wouldn't have gone so easy. I think we should talk to Spinelli and have him tell her to keep her mouth shut. Well, unfortunately, I can't have Michael's life depending on whether Maxie is going to keep her mouth shut or not. Get out. Well, I'm here to see your father. Go back to Brooklyn or go to hell. I don't really care. Wow. Such hostility. Are you mad about climate change? Because me too. I, I feel this chill. From you joke all you want. You will not take what's mine. Look, haven't we done this dance already? You took advantage of me getting shot and messed up to get ahead of me. You know what, kid? You and me, we're on two completely different ladders. But this is between you and your dad. And I'm making it between you and me. <laughs> you want it all, don't you, you greedy bastard? <clears throat> all right. Now you're getting personal. Why doesn't my dad see you for what you really are? I'm not going to just stand by and watch while you try to take down my father. Okay, if, if this is about the color palette for the base, the only other option was something called Jasmine Flower. No, this is not, a, it's not about decorating. Well, then why the urgent summons? Franco? No, it's not about Franco. I need you to tell me everything you saw outside Sonny's gate the night Claudia disappeared. You're not going to sit and wait until my father's ready to step down. In this business, if somebody's in your way, you get rid of them, right? Look, tell your dad I stopped by. Every move you make is sucking up. And that includes dating Lulu. You know she's close to my dad. Maybe I'll just talk to her, you know, let her know that uh, she's being used. You stay away from Lulu, okay? Mm, looks like I hit a nerve. I'll see you around. Look, people disappear all the time, Dominic. Look what happened to my stepmother. Don't think I can't what make what What's going on? Dominic thinks he can come in here and take my place, but he's not going to take what's mine. I'm going to get rid of you if it's the last thing I ever do. As you know, brings in the boys in blue. What are you reading? Uh, Woodlot 17. Surveyor's report. Elizabeth and I wanted to get some boundaries. I've been carrying this around with me, not knowing what to do with it. You want to join me? Are we celebrating? You can say that. What? I finally got it, Dad. What did you get? All of it. Now I'm just like you. 